Do you remember breaking rules at school? It was fun, wasn't it? Especially when you didn't get caught. Rules are everywhere, but most of them are external of us. But what about those internal rules we've learnt from our parents and from our teachers and from our religions and our cultures? And what about those beliefs we've developed about ourselves? We are our own fiercest critics. Releasing ourselves from these rules opens us to a whole range of possibilities, the most empowering of which is listening to and trusting our intuition. My name is James Mabberley. I'm an artist, a social entrepreneur and a writer, and I have four children who break rules regularly. I wrote this book because I realised that our intuition is the wisest guide that we will ever have, and yet most of us don't trust it. We would rather listen to the rules and guidelines handed to us by others. And yet, the moment we free ourselves enough to trust and listen to our intuition, everything changes. It's as if we get onto a different creative plane. Suddenly, life is exciting most of the time and not just every now and again. It is perhaps the most empowering thing that you and I could ever do. I also wrote this book for young people across the world who live under restricted rules and regimes, especially in Asia and in Africa. I do a lot of work with young people in Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe is ruled by a dictator and the country is ruled through fear and violence. He has cowed the population into a state of submission. Now I am not trying to enlist your sympathy. On the contrary, I'm asking you to support this book and by so doing provide them with the tools to empower themselves. I wish to distribute 1,000 copies of this book to young people across Zimbabwe this coming year to help them see things differently. I need your help. For as little as six dollars, your contribution can make a significant difference. Please have a good look at the reward structure. There are a number of rewards there that I think would be a great pleasure to own. In order to contribute, please press the green button on the right hand side on the pub slash page. You'll be taken through an easy process and remember, no money will be taken from your account unless I have reached the minimum requirement to see this project successfully completed. The more money I can raise on this campaign, the more books I can get out to Africa and the more money I can spend on marketing this book across the world. Please let your friends know about this by email or Twitter or Facebook so they too can become a part of this project. And please write a small note before you send it on so that it's personal. Thank you so much and as they say in Zimbabwe, Tatenda.